All right, so in today's 3 minute tech tip, we're taking a look at Blend Space. Blend Space is such a simple, powerful free tool to allow you to combine digital content to make your own lessons really fast, really easy, and really easy to access and consume. So to get started with Blend Space, you're going to go out to blendspace.com and you're going to want to sign up. And when it comes, you're going to get the option of teacher or student. You're going to choose teacher. Once you're signed up and logged in, you're going to land on the lessons page and you're going to want to click new lesson to get started. And it's going to create a new lesson for you. The first thing it's going to ask you for is a lesson title. So adding content to create your blend space is so easy. It's really kind of unbelievable how easy they've made this. So here you have some options of just adding text, creating a quiz, or dragging and dropping a resource. And over here on the right, you have the option of choosing from some different types of resources. By default is the YouTube search. And you can search out to a web resource and make that a part of your lesson. So I'm going to go ahead here and I'm going to drag a picture and I'm going to drop that as my first resource and I've gone ahead and renamed my lesson to Growing a Garden to give it some kind of a, uh, a topic to be about. And now let's just go ahead and type in a YouTube search, Growing Your Own Garden. Now, of course, you could also go to YouTube directly and poke around and check out different videos and come up with exactly what you want th that way and then, um, you know, make that what you search out here and you can probably search directly to the URL I believe. Uh, in this case this first one looks pretty good. Um, so you know assuming I've checked it out here's one about uh, somebody's backyard garden and tips on how to go ahead and do this. So boom now I've got two parts for my lesson. So over here on the right they've got other options so if I click on the G it does a Google search using the content I've already put in there the search phrase and it could search for images or search the web and then I can come down here and you can search for Flickr, you can search on Educ creations, guru, uh, insert a web page link directly. So if you have a URL, you can put that right in there. Um, what else do we got? Upload a, a different file or media of your own, uh, insert from Dropbox, insert from G Drive, Google Drive, or um, insert from your own bookmarks. So all kinds of ways to easily find and insert web content. Here you can see I've built out six pieces of content for my blend space, which auto saves as I'm working on it. To share it, I click on the share button, and then I've got a link, or I can embed it. I can share on Edmodo, Twitter, etc. It just it could hardly be easier. So here is my shared blend space, and the user just clicks on the little circle in each section to see the content. You can move through it one bit at a time with the arrows. I could play this video here. If I go to a web page, it's usually best to click the open new tab to view the web page, and that's it. And I come back to the blend space and keep moving through it. Uh, users can even add comments. Uh, blend space, quick, easy, awesome, great way to create digital lesson content.